Let me call you back, okay? Okay. Can you give me the address to your destination again? It seems as though my phone app is acting up. Yeah, no problem. It's uh, th 342 Orange Avenue. Well, we have arrived, sir. Uh, where are we? 342 Orange Ave. Orange Ave? I said Orange Street. No, you said Ave. Oh, God, what kind of idiot are you? I beg your pardon, sir. I mean, how dumb do you have to be to screw this up? What is wrong with you people? You don't have to speak to me like this, sir. You're a complete and utter idiot. Uh. Yes, service department, please. Thank you. Yes, this is Deborah Joyner, and I need a tow truck sent to me now. I have a flat tire. I'm not far from the dealership, actually. I'm on Bamboo Avenue and Third Street. What? You don't have any loaner cars available? <sighs> okay, so a tow truck would be here in 20 minutes? Okay, thank you, Hector. You too. Goodbye. <sighs> Hello, honey. This is Mom. Oh, I've been better. I have a flat tire, but I'm fine. <laughs> but I do need a favor. Can you meet me at the dealership? Good. It's Mango Park Tesla, the service department. And I'll text you the address now. Thank you. Love you. See you there. Bye-bye. Hello? Oh, yes. Yeah. No, 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 it was great. Dude, I'm telling you, they ate it up. Yeah. No, I nailed that interview. Let me call you back, okay? Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much for helping me punch up my resume. Sir, excuse me. What are you doing? You are in the wrong car. Yeah, no, the, the, the place is called Joyner and Stein. Excuse me. I interviewed me. for the regional manager position. Sir. <laughs> yeah, no, they bought it. Hook, line, sinker. Ooh. Like, just give me one second. I just got into an Uber. Uh, can I help you? Uh, yes, if you don't mind, can you give me the address to your destination again? It seems as though my phone app is acting up. Yeah, no problem. It's uh, th 342 Orange Avenue. Thank you. So yeah, yeah, no, fake it till you make it, right? But I just kept feeding them those buzz lines that you gave me, one after another, and they were just eating all my words. It was incredible. No, I literally had them hanging on every last word that I said. Yeah, no, I had them, dude. Uh, I mean, look, I just need to meet with the CEO next week, and, and the job is mine. We did it. Thank you so much for your help. You're the man, bro. Appreciate it. All right, later, dude. So oh, you just got out of an interview, huh? Uh, yep. Yeah, I did. Well, best of luck to you. I hope you get the job. I appreciate that. 
uh, I don't really think luck's involved. <laughs> wow, you must have a very impressive resume. Oh, I do. It's very impressive, but you know what? What? It's what? almost 100% fabricated. <laughs> really? Yeah, it is uh, safe to say I embellished a little bit. Uh, I basically tailored my resume for the exact candidate that they were looking for. So in the interview, they didn't know you were lying to them? No, oh, those idiots had no idea. They were literally ready to hire me on the spot. <laughs> wow, you don't say. Yep. Just have one more hurdle to get over next week. I gotta meet the CEO. She has to sign off on me, but job's mine. Uh, congratulations. Appreciate that. Um, look, I have some more calls to make, so if you don't mind, could you just, you know. Okay, well, no worries. I'll just keep to myself and for the remainder of the ride. Well, we have arrived, sir. Okay, great. Uh, where are we? At your destination, sir, 342 Orange Ave. Orange Ave, I said Orange Street. No, you said Ave. <sighs> no, I said street. We're on the complete other side of town. Oh, God, what kind of idiot are you? I beg your pardon, sir. I mean, how dumb do you have to be to screw this up? You literally just put the number into your GPS and you follow it. What is wrong with you people? Somebody with an ice of 75 could do this job. You don't have to speak to me like this, sir. You're a complete and utter idiot. Please, calm down. I'm giving you zero stars for this ride, and I'm writing a negative review. Best of luck with life, you old bat. Wow. Unbelievable. Mr. Campbell? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm Frank Campbell. Yes, uh, Mr. Joycener is ready for you. Okay, great. Perfect. Follow me, please. <clears throat> Hello, Mr. Campbell. Please come in. Hey, Ms. Joyner. It's very nice to meet you. Oh, I believe we've met before. Were you the... What's, what's going on here? Please have a seat. You have probably figured out by now that I'm not the Uber driver. In fact, my name is Deborah Joyner, and I'm the CEO of Joyner and Stein. I don't understand. I'll explain it to you, slowly, and I'll be careful to use small words so you will understand. Is this some kind of trick? No, no. You see, the day that we met, my car broke down, so I was borrowing my daughter's car. And you mistook me for your Uber driver, and you opened the door and you just jumped right in. Yeah, but you said that you were my driver. Incorrect, Mr. Campbell. As I recall, you were busy talking on your phone and you just completely ignored me when I told you you had the wrong car. Yes, but... And then you were denigrating my company and insulting my employees. So I decided to play along, keep my mouth shut. I was going to reveal my true identity at the end of the ride. But then you started berating and insulting me. Look, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry. I just, I don't think you quite understand. Oh, I completely understand. And then your resume is a complete fabrication. And you, sir, are a fraud and a jerk to boot. Look, I was having a very bad day. It's, it's not a reflection of. I am. Mm, well, 
we don't have room at this job for you. You see, we value honesty, integrity, and someone with a good heart. And you, sir, have neither of those characteristics. Okay, I, I definitely do. If you could just give me another chance, please. Another chance? Another chance to do what? Lie to me? No, thank you, Mr. Campbell. I'm sorry, okay? Mm. I'm sorry. Yeah, you should be. Well, I have a real busy day. So if you don't mind, you can just leave. Oh, and another thing, Mr. Campbell. Yes. Faking it until you make it never works. After a while, your true identity is revealed. Best of luck on your job search. Thank <laughs> you.